Hello, Divine Masculine. Welcome to Gemini Soul Tarot. All right, where are you guys moving forward on something? We got the chariot. Something that you're moving away from. Well, you're trying to get away from it quickly. What are you trying to get away from, my Divine Masculine? What are you trying to get away from? Three of Cups. Could be too much celebration, too many people, too many things going on in your life and you're trying to get away from it right maybe you've been doing a lot of celebration definitely be third parties right maybe lovers that you're trying to get away from old toxic ways behaviors of doing things and you're trying to move forward you definitely could just be moving forward to divine masculine to your happiness right you want to move forward to celebration a more happier place and time in life right now what else is you doing, masculine? Woo. Absolutely beautiful. Divine masculine. You got the devil card in reverse. Yes, you're leaving that behind. That's what you're getting away from, the toxic energies, the things that no longer serve you. You want to go on to a happier place at this time. There could have been friends, family, relationships, jobs. Jeez, y'all going to keep throwing y'all cards on the floor? Mm. They like, yes, because I'm sick and tired of it. I'm sick and tired of carrying everybody else's burdens, having to show up for everybody. I'm a divine masculine. Whether you're male or female, you are now on to stand in your power and walk away and release these burdens that no longer serve you, that they're not yours. And if they are yours, you're releasing them, and it goes right under the chariot, present moment, moving forward, away from the burdens. A ending to carrying burdens that either are yours or no longer yours or things that you have no control over, right? So that is what you're doing, masculine. This looks good. What else is the masculine doing at this time? Loving on they self. Thinking about commitment. Thinking about love. How to balance it out. How to be stable in love. How to be stable in a commitment. How to give love. How to ensure that the love is coming back is actually stable and for you. No more uh, taking in cups that's empty. You are making sure that now cups that come your way are already filled. You're not going to keep filling and pouring into cups because, right, you need to be balanced. You want a relationship that is totally balanced. The person that gets you or friends or family around you that totally gets you. And if they do not get you, you are moving on to a new adventure, Page of Pentacles. You are not going to be standing still anymore, making any offers to empty cups. Divine Masculine said, time up. Thank you for not locking them all the way on the floor. You're manifesting, Divine Masculine. You're manifesting, right? You got the Hierophant in reverse. You know why I say the Hierophant is in reverse? It's the new way you're doing things. You're not doing it the typical way anyway to, anymore. The way people think you should be showing up for a connection, what love you should be sharing, or what you should be doing. That's why I said it. No more of the hive mind. You don't tell me what to do anymore. Now I'm making changes and commitments to myself. That's what I feel you're doing, making commit. All right, Divine Jesus. Okay, y'all, can we keep on? Okay, I'm going to move over because it seems like y'all just throwing y'all opinions out here. You have the four of uh, cups in reverse and then the four of pentacles, four, four. You may be seeing four, four, but this here is no longer. You're like, look, I've been holding on to the sadness, things that I couldn't, I didn't have control over. It's been overtaking me. And okay, let's see this four of pentacles because you've been holding on to it. What are you doing now? Now that you're at this sad place, this place of cups being empty, like you see all these cups, but you were discontent. The cups didn't make you happy. You was not happy at all. And you have realized, right, I feel this is past energy that you had been holding on to that for dear life, not wanting to let it go because you didn't want to hurt anybody's heart. You didn't want to uh, break anybody's feelings or you didn't want to leave anybody out in the cold. Well, all the time you was holding on to something that didn't even make you happy, whether it was a long-term relationship, a relationship, a thought of how relationships should be, or how you should move forward in a relationship. No matter what, you realize this is the truth. 
This is what you've seen, that you had to balance this out for yourself. You had to move quickly. You had to communicate probably to someone. Like, I can't continue to show up for this because in, in, in this relationship that doesn't make me happy or situation because I truly do want my Ten of Cups and I can't get it by continuing to stay in this stuck energy of what's no longer working for me. And you don't have all the answers right now, right? Um, Divine Masculine, you got the uh, Knight of Pentacles. That's the slowest moving night. But you're taking your time to literally figure out what it is that you need to do so that you don't have to redo this again. The, the, you know, this is the night that wins. This is the night that does the work. This is the night that puts the puzzle together slowly. And at the end, you see the big picture. So you're working on putting that big picture together for you, Divine. Yes, you release. You like I don't even care about the secrets, the things I don't know. I don't care about that. It's like you're just running past that. Like okay, those are your secrets. My, I, it's not a secret anymore to me that I have to take care of me, that I have to do what's best for me, that I have to move in a different direction again. Ten of Cups under the bottom. It is no secret to you that you now want the Ten of Cups, and you want it at all costs, right? You, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Divine Masculine is like, oh, Divine Masculine, you either can be the high priest, or you can either, true, the empress. You can either be the empress, or you're moving towards the empress. Someone that you know cup is filled. Your higher uh, intuition is telling you to move towards this empress. Someone you see is beautiful, abundant, and nourishing. You feel is waiting on you, or this is your intuition telling you it is time for you to focus on you, that you have everything you need to leave things behind that no longer serve you, especially when you need to communicate it. The other thing is you need, the fact that you're dropping these birds and you no longer carry them, you also releasing all this toxic behavior that's been showing up or your codependence or whatever it is you felt you was doing, you're not doing that. Ten of cups again. Come on now. Come on now. This is simple. Divine masculine, you moving. You doing this. I don't care how slow it seems like you doing it. Don't let nothing rush you, right? Yeah. This is the five of swords winning at all costs. This is a good five of swords because you saying, look, I'm looking back at the situations that I dealt with and I wasn't fighting at all. Now I'm fighting for me at all costs. I'm showing up for me. That's five of swords is beautiful with this reading because you letting people know this time I'm doing it for me. You know why? Because that's been choppy over there. That didn't work out. Now I'm moving on to calmer waters. I'm leaving all that choppy water behind. You're like, no, I'm not doing that no more. I got to go. And if you meant to, oh, my God. Look, I cannot. How many times? Whatever you're doing, divine masculine, you keep doing it. Because your ten of cups is at the door. It's at the door. The seven of cups. This is you realizing you've been lost. You was lost. You had. You always had choices. And you, with the with the high priestess here, you may have choices, but you're going to be guided to pick the right cup. Your higher intuition will tell you this is not a secret. You will know exactly who this empress is, whether it's you or someone you're going towards, male or female, it does not matter. Okay? You Oh my oh my goodness. Divine. Look at this. This is where you're going. Look at this. This is where you are heading. And how will you get there? How will you get there? Four of Wands. It could be a twin flame. It could just be family, friends, commitment, someone you want to make an offer to that you see your empress, you see your happiness with. You're making that change. How are you going to get there? Five of Swords, winning at all costs. You're going to fight. You are fighting for your survival and love, life, commitment, jobs, happiness. Yes, you taking a leap of faith. You like, I don't know where I'm going and how I'm getting there. I'm taking my time. I may be moving slow, but at the end of the day, I promise you I'm going to arrive at your door, your gate, or wherever it is that you're going to. Oh, my God. I told you maybe moving slow, right? 
but the universe says three of wands and a sun card, the happiest card of the day. Hold on, divine masculine, because guess what? It is on its way. Your ships has come in. Your happiness is right there. You're going to have all of this. This is beautiful, and the reason why you're going to have it because you did the work. You, this, this, look, you got the food card, right? Moving towards your empress, empress, or knowing you are the emperor or empress and has all the tools that you need. Stability, laughter, fun, joy once again in your life. And then ten of cups, having it all full of emotions. Emotions involved. Where you was dealing with people was not emotionally available. Or you didn't feel that you wanted to commit or give to a relationship. You worked on your cup. You worked on your emotions, how to show up for a connection, how to truly care. Or someone has helped you grow and heal. And you are showing up for them where you may not have showed up or someone may not have showed up for you in the past. They are now showing up. And there is going to be a fight that I will not walk away away from this situation without being a winter, a winner. A winter could be in winter, but because you know you are moving a little slow, but don't worry about that because no matter how you get there, no matter how you get there, you're not gonna feel left out in the cold. The five of pentacles don't feel like I'm gonna do all of this and be left out of cold. Spirit said, You will not be left out in the cold. This work will not go in vain, that this is what you're doing. This is exactly what you're doing. Now you got the five of ones on the bottom, conflicted. This is confliction all around you. That's because people see, oh my goodness, people see you, right? Because you have now faced the truth and only want the truth of what it is that truly is a wish fulfillment for you. And that is all you're going to accept. And if people don't understand it, you are cutting them out. You're going to explain whether it's a relationship, job, or journey, or place you move, what you're doing, whatever it is. Your cup is now full. And you are going to sit up here and tell whoever do not agree with you so well, oh well. You need to go elsewhere because what I'm looking for is a wish fulfillment, happiness, bliss, and joy. And I need to communicate this clearly. You don't have to communicate anything to me. I'm going to communicate it to you. This is the only thing I want, and this is the only thing I'm going to fight for, and this is the only thing I'm going to show up for in my life. That is so beautiful, Divine Master. Go on now, Divine Master. What happened? Yeah. <laughs> you leaving this behind. You leaving this behind. You're like seven of swords, people not showing up, lying, stealing, cheating, or just not telling me what it is they want in my life with me, or why are they here, making me be confused and not sure of what it is that they're going to do has kept me stuck and stagnant. You're releasing that. Anyone doesn't know what they want in life and the direction they're going, tower, you're removing them. The towel is to remove all the things around you that no longer serve you, divine masculine. Okay? Closing messages for divine masculine. Strength, two of pentacles, balance. And yeah, look, you have the uh, five of cups. It's, you, you, you learn. I feel this is what you learn from the lesson. Well, someone will be missing you. Because they're going to miss that fiery energy that you gave them no matter whether they showed up or not. You allowed them to come in and out with this fire, passionate energy. And there may be someone you leave behind that you had so much love and passion for. I don't know if it's really love, but you was passionate about the relationship. Passionate about what it is you guys shared, where you were good friends or teenagers or and you grew up together. You were just passionate about it. But this is you realizing that it didn't make you happy and that you now have to walk away from it. And you have to balance yourself out. The strength card, right? I see this is somebody taming themselves. Like, I have to tame myself. I have to balance myself out. Know what it is that I want. Use all the strength that I have to move forward and stay balanced. And not let someone come in and throw you off your balance. Okay? Divine, masculine. Yes. And keep your guard up. Got the seven of wands under the bottom. Keep your guard up. Don't let nobody in there that's coming in to infiltrate and bring down what you're trying to build up. 
I feel that you're at the spot now where you're building from the inside out, right? You're building your foundation. You're getting the clarity. You're getting the understanding of who no longer serves you. And it's not easy because you got to leave people behind. It's not easy because you probably, they've probably been in your life for a while, but they can't go with you, Divine Masculine. You're making a change for a commitment. This clearly lets me know you want happiness. You want a commitment, right? And that you have all the strength to do this. This is beautiful that, yes, you do got to leave some behind, no doubt. But you have the justice card here. This is meant for you. This is equal balance. The direction you're going in will balance out because you are leaving the toxic behaviors behind. You're no longer dealing with the things that no longer make you happy. That's been connected to you, codependency, old relationships, uh, old beliefs, uh, whatever it is. You are releasing that because you truly, if your main two cards came out was you wanting to move towards your happiness and be stable in life with joy, family, friends, your cup full, someone else coming in and sharing your cup with you, right? This is beautiful. Divine Masculine, that is your reading. This is what I have for you. I will see you guys uh, next week. If anything resonated with you, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Love and light, Divine Masculine.